Good morning, Alvin. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. And the prince is in his little kingdom. How did you sleep? Amazing. You look like you did. I can go sleep again. <laughs> Somebody was in that room last night. I knocked on the door and I saw a hand come up. <laughs> It was one of the uh It was one of these pussy. It was one of the I knew it was something It was one of the pieces of trade from the corner of it. Good morning. This is how they wake up y'all. Now let's see the zoom. Come on! Well honest, how are you feeling? This is a big night for you. Oh, I feel pretty good, honestly. I'm pretty sure I'll get nervous once I get there, but right now, I feel like You look like you've been in the gym. So you've been prepping. Oh, so you've been prepping. Okay. Yes. You're Definitely. welcome. Definitely. Okay. <laughs> mm, that's what you got to do. got to wear people out of the gym. What are you looking forward to the most tonight? Um, honestly. <laughs> you better turn the light out. Honestly, let's see who wins this category, honestly. You well, why you? Why are you saying to see who wins? You maybe want to win the category. I am going to win, but... But you're going with your best foot forward? Yeah, of course. Okay. Definitely. All right, well... I, watch it. I'm getting interviewed. So am I. The people, the people, the people saw that. You abused me. Now let's see the Zoom. <laughs> what you over there eating? Pineapples. Oh. What that mean? Somebody get ready to get a treat? <laughs> no. That's what me you going at me. What's... Can I have one? I can't. I, I can't, I can't be blue. Sweet energy. <laughs> I, I, I can't be blue. Either. Look at Rebel, yo. What do you get? That back, that cunt back. Rebel said, he touched the small of my bag. <laughs> <laughs> Lord Jesus, yo. <laughs> well, damn. <laughs> Rebel said, he touched the small of my bag. Kyrie, Kyrie did his power on me, bitch. Little demon. My sweet powers activate. Shape up. A body. <laughs> Ooh, that little pineapple have a lot of it. I got a seven. That was an edible pineapple. <laughs> mm. So, how was your travel yesterday to North Carolina? I was asleep. Mm. <laughs> I was asleep. Well, I had to fight, the whole time. I had to fight all the people. Oh, yeah. We snuck out, um... Snuck out our seats and snuck into the, uh... The pictures on the, um, plane. The, the, the bigger, the bigger, what you call it, snuck right in there, like, yup. I can't wait till, um, Marcus get here, because Marcus is gonna, and Kyrie gonna race in the back. Oh, Marcus come in? Uh-huh. Oh, Jesus. Can Lamar come Can I have to eat all those, please? Yeah. Lamar come Uh-huh. Lamar's coming? Yeah, they're coming. Alright, come on. Him, Mufasa, and, um, Marcus. Oh, Oh, oh yeah. CJ? Yeah, it's, it's, it's a lot though. Oh, okay. Okay, let me just take one more. <laughs> Is it probably? I don't know. If it was. I said something to him, you know. No, he can't. If no. it was. Okay, he can't. Um, he can't. Fight, 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 the guy, the, 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 I got you. I got you. I got you. I got you. Show you know this move, though. I got you. Show you know this move, right? Sir. All right, come on. Brother, I like it. Every time, my friends. Yo, we have a lion. And who are you for the people? What's up, brother? I don't know. I'm just tired. Turn it down real quick. Turn it down real quick. I mean, y'all look a Mufasa. Oh, yeah. I got some weed. It's in a car. Child, I'll do one. Why you taking drugs? 
Can you put your dick so on? So I'll, I'll, I'll let you put your dick on. You want to touch it? You want to touch it? That shit can look like a why did you look late just like you? It looks late over there. Okay, the chicken is wet and like you. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, why she can't take me over there? I don't <laughs> Marcus, you been worse than me, but I ain't bringing like a whole, a whole lot. Last car, you taking the last car. Oh, he got. Oh, shut up again. Oh, 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 oh. y'all are so slick. Oh, no, you got shot, but you gotta do it again. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. He cheated. Oh, really? I didn't even cheat. I was listening to him. He no. tried to get yeah, go. I used to listen to Kyrie too. He was listening. Damn, Sean, you're not even playing the game. Get out. He's cheating. They cheated. That's all we done. Nobody in Jersey can play. They lost the last three games. They lost the last three games. I don't know what you're talking about. We did not lose anything. There you go, shuffle up. these cards like a big kid. Lamar and Marcus <laughs> lost the, the last four games. Um, <laughs> we just shot the first eight. Laid the two The score is 1930. Uh, they've been no, throwing so much shade. to 30, not 1930. They've been throwing so much shade. Sam, we ain't got shot eight. Y'all got shot eight. Y'all was shade because we beat y'all. We got 190. Y'all have 30. I know. It's going to be a miss. Y'all have 30. You just cut it. I don't know what's going to happen. You're just cutting. Huh? Just regular cut. No, that. Like oh my god, you. I did so! Gas on both of them. He did sex straight cut straight here. Bless. Thank you. Bless the cards. Thank you. Thank okay. you. Okay. We good. We good. We good. Which episode is this? We don't know which one this may be. This may be. Uh, <laughs> what's up, y'all? I'm, I'm the legendary Damo Alpha Omega, of course. What else you want? Oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so first though, Damo, uh, uh, this is Sean's first time at the road to doing a grand prize. This is not your first time doing a pretty boy gr uh, grand prize, been, no, but it's been a long time. It's been a long time, yeah. So when I sent you this category, what was it about it that made you say, you know what, let me let me really go all out for this one? Um, Because I just felt like it was time again, and then like I had been like pulled out all my chops um, in a long time. So I was like, okay, it's a perfect time to just, you know what I'm saying? And plus, being into, you know, my new home, mm. I felt that it was just right to show out, so. Um, to both of y'all, so tell them what the, well, they'll see later on, but what was your inspiration? What Sports Illustrated cover did you, are you bringing to life? Um, well, I mean, like, but, go ahead. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> so, um, mine is um, Giancarlo Stanton. He's used to play for the Miami Marlins, and now I believe, I don't know what team he's on, but I watched him get painted for a Sports um, Illustrated magazine. I thought the baseball jersey was real, but it's actually okay. painted on. So, and you waiting for your body painter now to do that part? Yes. <laughs> oh, okay, that's what's up. And Domo? So I, uh, it was um, a picture of Muhammad Ali. It was two, but then when he was Cassius Clay. When he was known again. Cassius Clay, yes. And so I the whole theme of the magazine just caught my attention and everything. So I thought it was 
three thousand dollars worth. Okay, well, I think that both of y'all put a lot of effort into. Yes. They'll see all the effort that you did for yes. that one and whatever uh, you did for that. Okay, so what are you looking for most forward to tonight? I'm looking forward to just ha having a good time, honestly. Cause yeah. I, I mean, I've been just, me and just more so are just, you know, of course, winning is the goal. But um, just uh, making it known of, of, who, of who, who I am in the ballroom scene. And just, um, yeah, man, just showcasing it. And question to both of you, what, besides the realness part, which is the, the important part, the pretty boy part, what are some of the things you did to prepare for the pretty boy part? <laughs> no, I mean, listen, man. I can't believe they really just tried to play oh, us. Oh, oh, like, oh, no, 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 why the fuck would I say you hit the line? Do you hit the line? There's no real space playing. So we just got it back. I don't know what to do about it. I don't know what to do about it. Don't rush me. It's gonna come when it comes. Yeah, I think it's gonna come. What the hell is it that you get me? You just got it. I don't see how they wanna rush us, but when it was their turn, but they hold, hold, don't rush me. You know they was saying that. He just said there's no good space playing. Why did you turn me like that? Okay. Well, I guess it gives them more time to dry, right? Yeah, How long have you been painting for? Um, maybe 15 years. Oh, wow. So in this process right here that you're doing, I know you're doing the base. Yep. What is the most important part of it? Um... Getting a good coverage on the base mm -hmm. and then setting it with a setting powder. Okay. Before you move on. With looking at this picture, would you have thought that was painted? Yes. Oh, you would have. When well, you get in, because I know. Oh, because you know. Right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you've seen that before. Yeah. Got you. Would, would you think that was a good example of good work? Oh, absolutely. Okay. It took a lot of paints to get shading and. Mm hmm. Because you know, it looks so real. Yeah, it looks great. Yeah, we've done like, you know, body painting models for sponsorship events and people don't realize they're walking around naked until it's like, oh snap! Wow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> there are no clothes. So how many coats would he need, actually need to achieve that look? Um, maybe two or three. Two or three? Okay. Yeah. It depends on the, on the skin tone. Gotcha. Um, and one of the things I told them is, you know, make sure you have no lotions or oils on mm -hmm. because that helps the paint to just... Right. I was telling them earlier not even to shake you know, at some time so nothing irritates or nothing like that. Right. And sometimes it takes longer to take the lotion. Oh, no, I'm not taking it. <laughs> All right, we'll come back in another 10 minutes and see where you're at. Okay, now we're putting the red on.
people out there. Oh, I ain't gonna say names. <laughs> oh, 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 we played there. But Jersey people really, you have never heard of Jersey people who can play spades. They North Jersey just got beat by, huh? North Jersey people can play. North Jersey just got beat by, by two people. It's the, uh, it's the, uh, I thought that was the, um, okay. Ryan's hand. Like, you got me. It's Marcus. Marcus is from Chicago. Clearly, they can't either. You know that motherfucker. Ryan's hand. Ryan's hand. Walk up in the street. Right, right here, right here on the sprint, right here. All right. Are you ready? Somebody behind y'all. Oh, car. Oh wait, 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 wait. wait. They're turning. Are you ready? Get set. Go. Ooh, that was a tie. All right. On your mark. Get set. Go. Uh, you went before he even said go. Uh, Actually, he took off right when he said go. <laughs> Somebody got to go. He said on your mark. Get set. New York versus Atlanta. Let's go. New York versus Atlanta. <laughs> On your mark. Get set. Go. Oh shit. Ooh. That was a tie again or was that a right side? On your mark. Get set. Go. Cesar here, founder father. You know how it is. Alpha Omega, baby. Big things in store. With the icon. <laughs> the other icon. The icon. <laughs> I'm with the newer icon of the icon of the icon. Okay. <laughs> Pioneer, Hall of Famer. Hey, Cesar, I love you. How do you? We gotta talk. You know what we gotta talk about? We have to talk about a few things, right? Yeah, we do. The phone booth. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> they haven't got. We, we have, They need conversation about that. We got it. Um, before the end of the bit, we're gonna give y'all a whole context of that day, the stress that he was under. The, you he know. was under y'all. He cursed me out. Oh my god. But but I apologized two days before that. I love him. He did apologize. <laughs> y'all forgetting that? <laughs> he did. He did. Well, it showed me. But throwing the ball is hard, y'all. So <laughs> we, we're gonna get to that. We're gonna get back to that.
You know, you want to be really like, oh, that was pretty. Yeah. Oh, that was real pretty. Ooh. That's what I learned from you. That's what you said. Oh, you said. Cool. You said. You said. <laughs> that was beautiful. I think so. <laughs> yeah. I thought so. That was lovely. Yeah. Think about it. Come on, you got a boy. <laughs> what, 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 what,
and it's like it just doesn't, it looks like it's twisting you in a knot. Oh, Marianne, let's do it. How'd you feel? Yeah, I need like a lot of, I need, yeah, I can, I, when you, when you, it, the bulb was like that, you know? I can't, so if you, if, if you're not gonna like, say I'll pass this round. Yeah, because if, if you're not, if you're not gonna give your best here in practice, I'd rather you take a moment and then come back when you're ready. Yeah, y'all, you get, you gotta push, and, I, and, I, and I'm still missing the expression. Like you gotta have fun, you gotta make eye contact, you got to give me something on your face. You're just too beautiful not to smile. So I need some smile. I need a I wink. I can't wink, but I need a wink. <laughs> I need a kiss low. low. I, need, I need a heart. You know, I need some titties shaking. I need a catwalk, catwalk look. Brush my shoulder off. Hey, how I need a praise. The stinky you. bitch, you did that good. I need something. You, you did know? that good. I keep, I keep seeing intention. Like, right, I'm, the intention is it. I'm not trying to fall. I'm not trying to like, like, so what? If you fall, you fall. Like, yeah. like, you can make a fall look. Look amazing. Where, wherever your body's like, just fuck it. Just, just like, just let it go. Like, because then you did this thing and then you were like, <laughs> the little poison. Like, when it's like, you steadied yourself on your feet before you actually was able to like get down to what you were doing. Like, if you gonna fall, just fall. Each other. Uh, the 
Why the t-shirt? Why are you going down? All y'all next to each other. Yeah. Let's see y'all up. Give each other space. Exactly. You're probably just going to fall fast than anything. What is that guy? This yeah. Yeah. Noah, over here. Yeah, everybody stand. Oh, go this way, Noah. Not, yeah, kind of in there, Lindsay. All right, all y'all do the dip, same time. All y'all should be landing the same time. Two, three, down four. So two turns. Where? The dip's on four? Yes. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, down four. Nope. One more time. One more time, get that perfected. Try a different span. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, down four. One more time. Omarion's well, timing is better than yours. Come Pick on. It. One more time. Try, try to, another leg on another spin. Let's spin on another leg. Five, six, Ooh. seven, eight. One, <laughs> two, three, down, four. <laughs> now, try again. Adam, you're still delaying yourself. You're not flowing because you're making yourself think that you need to do another spin. Just spin. Here we go. Oh, that's hard. One more time, Adam. Do it one more time. Five, six, a little go. One. Two, three. Exactly. 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 One more time. Exactly. Do the spin without the arms. No arms with the spin. No arm. Five, six, seven, go. One, two, three, down four. Wow. You gotta be down on Noah. Four. That was clunky, Noah. Do it again. Everybody has to be down on four. Because it's like straight to the point. Yeah, Adam, it looks so beautiful when you're doing it like that. Yeah. Five, Noah, that was clunky. Extend that back. Remember, you're more graceful. You remember, you're skinny. So, yeah. Two. Do that again. Come on. Five, six, seven. I'm over here with my daughter, KK. Y'all already know K O me Alpha Omega. KK Cash. Hold on. You know, one of the things to my heart and to my stomach, as you all can see, is food. Right. Will we pause that real quick for me? And Kaomi's here cooking. For those, like I told you guys before, she is from G. Jamey. Oh, it's a lot of pepper. I don't know if I eat that. It's literally yeah. one pepper. <laughs> so, KK, K K, what are we making over here? So, we're making curry chicken mm. with some steamed rice and some fried peppers. Okay. Well, we can keep it rolling. Well, I don't know if we're going to have enough food because like a lot of people coming over here now. Who is? <laughs> Saying I got to call back Mercedes. I got to a bunch of people calling my phone. Oh, Mercedes coming? Uh, yeah, I have to call back right now, I think. See, we didn't know that. We did not know that. What you said, Jarabi? Wait, what? What? What is going on? <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> All right, girl. I'll talk to you later. Sister, what? Stop your mouth. I'm around all these sexy bitches. I'm scared. I'm with this. Her name is Jabuli. <laughs> no, it's not. Jabuli. Stop it. Be nice. Talk about something. Did you pay for that? I thought, do I need to pay for this? It's just getting crazy. Wow. Right, we walk right out there. Listen, Jabuli. <laughs> How you What's up, y'all? <laughs> we got my. Like, we got KK and Did you get the wine? Hi. How you doing? Oh, you want me to like you like pour a glass? Yes, please. I definitely will pour you a glass, my baby. <laughs> what made you decide to come and cook, you know, we use some of your talents in this kitchen? Well, you know what, because I've been missing for a couple months, mm. and I just want to know, make my presence be known. You know, so. my shawty like to cook for me. Period. You know what I mean? Get off of me. <laughs> I'll be she really? got it out. <laughs> oh, look, look, look. Oh, my God, get off of me. Oh, come on, love. Okay. 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 All right. Yeah, man, started everything. Can't be scared, y'all. I'm putting it on him. <laughs> <laughs> Yep. You look like you could put it on a bitch, you know? You know what I mean? Pause on that, it's coming? Um, I don't know. They just, they said they had a brunch, they about to leave an hour, then I guess they may be on their way. Ah, oh, okay. Alright, look at that. Caleb. Okay, Irene. Here he is. Wow, big Ronnie. Caleb, what would you say is your style? My style? What's your style? Um... I like to feel cute. So whatever, I don't know, whatever feels cute to me, whatever feels pretty to me, you know, whatever my eye catch and whatever I feel like that day, that's what I do. Okay. And Jarabi, yeah. what's your style? You know, ball shorts, joggers. <laughs> my aesthetic is up with that. Jerseys, Vicky suits. 
<laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> Why you? No, it's not. She playing some hood shit, some yeah. fuck shit. Yeah, my aesthetic is all that bitch though. No, That's KK, what... we've talked about it before, but you know, I get so many of these guys, you know, mm -hmm. that hit me up when I post you up, and a lot of them are gay men, mm -hmm. and I know they follow you to your page and mm -hmm. things like that. What is your thoughts of when gay men uh, come to you to tell you that they're attracted to you and things like that? I'm very flattered. I'm actually even more flattered <laughs> when a gay man. You know what I'm saying? Find me attractive than a regular dude. Why? Um, because I feel like, you know, that you gotta be something. You know, for the for a gay man to be like, yo, you are really pretty, or you're really dope. I feel like, you know what I'm saying? It's just not normal, and you gotta be stand out for them to actually come up and say that. So I feel more, you know what I'm saying, honored. How do you feel about trans girls dating gay men? Um. Matter of fact, how do you feel about dating gay men? I mean, I, me personally, I think it's delusional. It's a whole bunch of delusion going on. It, it really is because a gay man is gay because what he's attracted to men. He's not attracted to women. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Maybe he want to play around with you. That's fine. You know what I'm saying? On a drunk night or something. But do we want to be with you? I don't know. I'm, I'm not convinced to want to be with one. So, how you feel about it, sis? I don't know about that. I don't want it. Come on, for real. How do you feel about it? I don't be on all that. I'm not rocking with that. Oh, okay. How do you feel about, do you believe in pansexualism and everything? Um, Can't yeah, I, I do. <laughs> I do believe in that. Mm. But, I don't know. I feel like that's another, that's another reason too for people to get freaky. So I don't know. I really mm. don't know. I mean, whatever, whatever you want to do, right? But, I don't know. What's your type? My type? Your somebody type. who is confident in knowing what they want. Mm. And if, if this person can convince me that you know what I'm saying? I'm enough for it for for him or her. Well, him, because I'm not in the hers. Well, you said yeah. her, so maybe no. a little bit. Yeah, so I'm attracted to, to a guy that <laughs> is confident. This one crazy. Jabuli is crazy. He don't have shit right now. Mm hmm What's your type, Jarabi? You know, I just need a rough neck, but um, you know, I need a man's man. I mean, because you know, I'm kind of rough. I'm a little aggressive. So I need my man to be more rough and aggressive than me. So I can feel like, you know, I'm not trying to overtake because I like to overtake situations. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I like somebody who's confident. Like I said, confident. Yeah, of course. And confident. you got to be manly. Very manly. It's like a manly man. You know what I'm saying? Like, you got you to gotta be rough around the edges. Like, I don't want nobody too, uh, you know what I'm pretty. saying? Yeah, I don't want that. Fix my toilet. Want I need big hands. I need the calluses yeah. on them and stuff. Like, I need all of that. Yeah, I'm with you with that. Yeah, that like, you like, on? Rough hands and stuff like that. Yeah. So they were like, oh no, I'm not doing that. I'm not taking out the garbage. That makes you be like, mm -hmm. you could, why uh, wouldn't you take out the garbage? Because I'm taking the garbage. Out. And I'll take you out with it. That part. You're right. The other day, when I was going to wait till she get here, Infinity had put a post mm -hmm. about partnerships. And mm -hmm. how do you feel like, do you feel like when you're in a real relationship, it should be a partnership? Like, as far as like, okay, if he's paying the rent, should you be paying the utilities? Um, no, I'm an old school girl. I'm not paying for nothing. Now, if I'm not paying for nothing, that's just me and just what, I, what I'm used to and what I want from me. I'm not paying for nothing. So if, I'll be somewhere in the middle. Like, if he's paying for the dishes, paying for everything else, I'll get my own nails and hair done then. <laughs> so wait, 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 so let's talk. Let, let's talk. Mm -hmm. So you just said you're old school girl, right? Mm -hmm. So if he's taking care of everything financially, for example, mm -hmm. what are the things that you are taking care of? I'm making sure he's happy. I'm making sure he's motivated. I'm, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so his happiness, his motivation. When he come in the house, you don't really have to do too much. You know what I'm saying? He can take his feet up and relax. Your right. Thing. You know what I'm saying? Because he pays for everything. You know what I'm saying? So that's why it should. You know what I'm saying? I should have the availability. To make you happy because if i gotta go out and hustle and we both go out and hustle don't look at me and expect me to have sex with you when you want to baby i'm tired so, <laughs> so if he's expecting you to work don't expect too many things from you basically exactly so i see you when i want to see you i fuck you when i want to fuck you um it's just really on my time if that's what it is so robbie it's always on my time <laughs> if i don't feel like doing it it's not happening no matter what. No matter what. Because I'm just not, I'm just like that. <laughs> I'm just but like I, I like definitely that. play my part though. I'm not just a girl that just thinks she pretty and just, you know what I'm saying, just mm -hmm. want somebody to take care of her because nothing in life is free. But I'm willing to, you know what I'm saying, to make you happy. I'm, you know what I'm saying? It's a lot of stuff that we put up with as women. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? With men, it's a lot of stuff I pay. I like pay what? What are some of the things that you put up with that you know come with the territory, but normally you would not deal with it? Um... 
for instance, communication. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm realizing that a lot of dudes, men, especially black men, they don't really know how to communicate. Mm. Just on a basic level. And you know what I'm saying? So if I'm sitting here, I have to put up with that. And I'm going to be aggravated and stuff like that. I'm not paying for nothing. You pay for it. So you said, so what do you mean on basic communication? Like trying to find out how they feel, anything? Exactly. Like, how you, like basic questions like, how's your day going? Sometimes you can't get a, a honest, a honest answer. It's just, you know what I'm saying? Mm. Just, it was good. Why was it good? What, what did you do? Today? What happened today? You know what I'm saying? Mm. It's like, they don't know how to communicate. Where do you think that comes from? I mean, just being a black man, I feel like it's a lot. It's a, it's a lot. And obviously, you know what I'm saying? And a lot of black men don't get a lot of love. Mm. So I just feel like they just don't know how to, especially with their feelings and what they want and stuff like that. We mm. know how to do that. Mm -hmm. But I just feel like, you know, that alone is a lot to deal with. To deal with. So... Uh, so I was having a conversation recently with someone very close to me, and they were talking about they feel like a lot of trans women are nurturers by nature. Yeah, I know I am. Yeah, a nurturer by nature, a motivator, but you know, mm -hmm. really trying to get behind men. Do you feel like sometimes trans girls love too much? Um. Yeah. Yeah. That's the honest truth. Yeah, because I'm a victim of that too. Just like kind of lose yourself into somebody because you know what I'm saying. You you want them to to be happy just as much. You know what I'm saying? As they make you feel happy. Mm -hmm. So then we, you know what I'm saying? We kind of like put ourselves last in front of them. Mm -hmm. So we do do that. I'm a victim of that, mm -hmm. for sure. Yeah. To bully? I don't know. I don't do none of that. <laughs> what? I don't know about none of that. I be by myself. I'm best alone. I'm a lone rider. I don't know about all that relationship. But are you happy, myself. though? Like, for real, for real. Like, are you I'm happy? I'm happy as when I'm by myself. Are you really? I really am. Okay. I'll be stressed out. I don't, I don't like But why? Stressed. Because I don't have to That's a about right it. why. Why are you happy is by yourself? Because I can control everything in my life. But why not control everything in your life and also not be lonely? Because, you know what I'm saying? Mm. I mean, I'm I feel like we do this too. But I'm not you have to train them on how you want them to treat you. I don't feel lonely because I have so much. I have my support system is so big. And, like, I already feel like I split myself in, like, four different ways anyway. So, to be with somebody else is to split myself another fifth way. I don't have that. But anymore. don't you want to be hold and loved and kiss on your forehead and tell you you're beautiful and, you know, to feel like a woman. Um, you know what I'm saying? I, you don't I'm need so, a man to feel like nah, a woman. Like I, I feel like I'm very secure in my woman that I really don't mm -hmm. need any of that. I mean, if that's how you feel now, then who can blame the girl? You know what I'm saying? If that's how she genuinely feels and you feel like you're happy, then that's fine. I'm but, like, I mean, I feel like happiness should not be... Because of an individual, it should come from you. But don't cover it up and say you're happy though, just because you don't know how to express yourself and ask for what you want. And no, like, I, I'm, I'm happy like this. You know what I'm I'm, I really, I, I enjoy my time with myself that I enjoy being in someone else's company romantically. Yeah. Because I just don't be feeling like that. Mm -hmm. Why not? <laughs> it's not fun. Like, it's not fun. Like, cause it's fun for me, like to go out on dates. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? Not if I'm, but it's fun to, you know what I'm saying, to get pretty and feel like I a girl. Prefer, and... I think it, honestly, I really have more fun going out with my friends than I do going okay. out. Okay. Maybe that's just a stage in your in your life because you're, you're yeah. younger, right? Yeah. So, how old are you now? I'm 26. How you so feel maybe about a stage. That? How you feel about what she's saying? How do you feel about it? I feel like it's a stage because, you know what I'm saying, we, especially when I didn't really know what I want, that's probably a safe way to do because, you know what I'm saying, it took me to like I'm 30 to figure out and now that I'm transitioning, you know what I'm saying, to figure myself out and find out what I want, mm -hmm. what I like, you know what I'm saying, so maybe that's just the stage she at right now. A guy that you like hit over heels like we'll do dumb stuff for and you know you do, do dumb, dumb stuff? Yeah. Like, sometimes, like me, in my past, like, I know I'm being dumb. Like, okay, girl, you know you're being dumb. Yeah, but when I, I was, love like, him. really, really young. Huh? When I was, like, really, really young, before I turned, like, I don't know, before I turned, like, Do you feel like you're scared of that? Scared of what? The feeling of being hard. You know what I'm saying? I don't think I'm scared of it. I just don't know. I just don't think I'm just, I'm not ready for that. Yeah. Like, I'm not mentally ready for that. I'm still immature in a lot of ways. Do you enjoy the sex? I mean, I enjoy when it happens. But do you enjoy sex? Do you crave sex? No, I don't really crave sex. Like okay, maybe that's that's probably a key reason on why you don't. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's not, not to divulge, thing. but me and her yeah. had a conversation about this. Yeah. So what you're saying, I want is something I think is very real. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. I don't. I don't know. I don't really be like sex. Is, I I will feel better if somebody just laid next to me. So you like, like intimacy? Touching yeah. me and like in a sexual way, like it, yeah. Like, I mean, me too. I don't though. Really like. But you never had a feeling. I feel like you're so young. You never had a feeling like, oh, I'm, I'm horny. 
Of course I get that feeling, but it's like, it's not like, I don't know, maybe it's not standard feeling. Like, mm-hmm. more than, not how that's when I really like, I like to go to sleep. Okay. Like, like, I like, okay, come you on. Like you cuddle. like to cuddle. You like to like, 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 go to sleep. Right. Genuinely, like, cuddle and go to sleep is like, if I can make it through a night of that, then maybe I start to like you more. But if I, I feel like if it's, if you like pressure me for sex and stuff, I get turned off so fast. Like, you know, really I, I'm, I'm, I'm not, I feel like you're me. going for a sexual situation. I, I don't even want to talk to you more. And you know, I'm different. Actually, when I'm intimate with somebody, some days I'd rather just give you what you want, which is sex, than. Now I don't have to deal with you. I don't have to cuddle with you. I just want that moment, you know what I'm saying, to myself. So it's easier for me to just give you what you want, which is some sex. And I'm like, okay, cool. You know what I'm saying? Me, I'm not big on cuddling, so I get that. Why? Huh? Why? Because I don't know. I just... Did the intimacy scare you? You know, no. Actually, it depends on the person. Mm -hmm. It it solely depends on the person. Because I got to be really, really into you. You know what I'm saying? To be like, oh, I want to cut. I got to respect you. I got to, you know what I'm saying? If you just, uh, some sex, I don't want to cuddle with you. No. I'm not doing all that. I just like, no, but you know what's so crazy? When they come to say, I'm so lazy. Like, I don't want to do nothing. I don't want to keep my back arched. I don't want to, I just want to lay down. Like, just do what you got to do. Come on. That's how I feel. So like. just, you don't want to give them no fun at all? No, go look for somebody else. That's what you want. That's something that's 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 deep in you that you have to figure that out. Then why? Yeah. Because I, most of the girls I know that are into it, right or wrong. That's the right. whole. They want to. They want to get in their zone, and they want to. That's yeah. when. They, that's when they get their sex kitten on. Yeah. A lot of girls get confidence from that too. Actually, <laughs> it don't. It don't. Do, it don't do that for me. I feel like I'm more confident. I, I really do. Feel so, dude, have you ever had with a guy and you like felt like this to both of y'all? You like, damn, I know I put it on him. Yeah. No shade, maybe I'm overly confident, but pretty much every time. Maybe like one or two times, like, yeah, that wasn't my best. But, you know what I'm saying? Because, I, again, I am very submissive. I That's what gets maybe me off. Maybe that's my problem. I, it gets me off to know that, you know what I'm saying? This mm. guy is really, really maybe, wanting or something. Maybe you know what I'm saying? So I, 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 put in, I put in the work. I you think know? I'm more dominant okay. by nature. So when they, I'm like, you want me to submit and all that, then I'm like, it's like, it's no. very easy. For like, it's not like if a guy yeah. says like, do this during sex, I'm like, I'm not doing it now. Maybe it's yeah, like a, it's good. like a flip note. Maybe because Kim, you're aggressive with everything else in life. You're like, you're a go getter. You're on your shit. Yeah. So maybe in those moments, the flip side of you is that you want to be submissive. Yeah. You want to be, I don't want to say dominated, but you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You want someone else to take charge. Yeah. And I'm, I, you know, because a lot of, a lot of girls too, they don't really, they think that's being weak or something. To be submissive. I enjoy that as a woman. I do. Maybe for Jarabi in those moments of the releasing that submission, that's, she can't do that. She can't release that that feeling of knowing that. I like that. to be in control. All right. Yeah. I like to be in control of everything that's going on. That's probably my problem. I'm controlling. Yeah. I know that about myself, though. I'm not going to mess with nobody if they don't genuinely make me happy. You know what I'm saying? Like, like me, though. When, you know what I'm saying? If I don't get giddy. So, so for me, you know what I'm saying? I want to make sure... I have that connection. They feel the same way about me. You know what I'm saying? So if that's how I feel about them, I'm going to go above and beyond if I really do love a man. Yes, absolutely.